What's going on people? I'm wishing you all a happy holidays and a happy new year. I just want to say thank you for 2025 and today we've got a quick video just running over some of the updates on Camcorder V2. So let's jump straight into it. So as you can see on the right we've completely overhauled all of our features. I'm just going to turn the HUD off for the sake of this tutorial and then we've now got input size so we can work with vertical 4k or any resolution and it matches perfectly. And now let's jump into our style. And this style is where we can choose between four different styles. We've got real cam GPU. This will be heavy on the GPU as the static and a lot of the stuff is procedural. You've got tape cam, which kind of mimics that 90s VHS style. I really love this effect. Um, this has lots of individual unique features as well that can be sort of manipulated down in the settings. Then we have night cam. This is something uh, that kind of resembles that night cam look that you used to get on the, also the old 90s uh, VHS recorders. I think this is a really cool and stylized feature, especially for music videos. So let's jump in and have a look at the effects and features. First of all, I'm just going to come to the global effects and this affects everything. So depending on what style you're on, this will just sort of be an overriding or an overarching effect that uh, works on all styles. So as you can see, we've got 4x3 motion trails, which is a GPU um, effect uh, and the gate weave. Once you're on your specific style, you want to come down to the settings that relate to that um, style. So I'm on night cam, the preset night cam. So you want to come down to night cam settings. We've got glitch amount, damage quality, resolution, grain size and grain strength. Have a mess around with these. There's uh, lots of possibilities and lots of different outcomes you can achieve. But ultimately, it's uh, totally down to your taste uh, and your style. Now I'm just going to come back to tape cam um, and take you through some of the features we have on this. So you select your style, the tape cam, and you come down to the tape cam settings. Um, and we've got lots of features, more than the, uh, the night cam settings. Uh, I really wanted to add the features in this to make it sort of as variable and as, um, you know, as customizable as possible. As you can see, we've got the flicker opacity, the color bleed, which is that red that sort of bleeds through the back, um, the dirt density, the noise scale, and the signal noise. And you can imagine if you really play around with this, you can get so many very different looks. Now, the Digicam kind of replicates the early 2000s camcorders that you would get. Uh, the, a lot of them would usually have the interlacing lines, sort of the, the highlight bleeds and the highlight roll-offs. So as you can see here, you've got the highlight strength and highlight blend, and you kind of get that reflected light that the camera would always pick up. Um, a lot of options here as well, so play around with it and see what you get, but this um, is a really good uh, choice to emulate that sort of early 2000s look. You can also adjust the interlace frequency and the interlace strength, just so you can really dial in your, your options and really dial in the style that you're looking for. I mean, that Y2K looks so varied, um, and a lot of the cams have varying differences between the years, um, especially from 90s to the early 2000s. So once again, mess around with the features um, and see what you come up with. This plugin works really well on logos and sort of stylized HUD elements and all sort of little things like that. It just really adds the detail in making it or giving it that Y2K look. Um, so this is the Thrasher intro. And as you can see, I'm just flicking through some of the effects here. You can see it here from um, as it is without the effect on. And then straight away, you've kind of got that 90s uh, camcorder look that we're looking for. And that's pretty much it, guys, just for this quick little update video. I just wanted to run through uh, before the new year um, some of the updates that we've been working on on camcorder. We've also got new plugins coming out. We've got Rough Press. We've got the Mixed Media version 2. We've got uh, Film Print Pro 2. Essentially, everything we've done in the past, we've updated, rebuilt, and we've just added tons more new features. Um, but yeah, so that's pretty much it. There will be another video coming out in a couple of days just to touch on Rough Press. Um, that's a really exciting uh, small little plugin that we've been working on that sort of mimics the mixed media sort of style. Um, but yeah, I hope you all have a happy new year uh, and thank you for watching the video. Peace. And if you're using DaVinci Resolve, guys, check out the full collection of my editing plugins at Bluetooth.com. These tools seriously level up your workflow. From CRT, VHS, and animated titles, I've got you covered. Pack up your bags and we was up, we was up all night, right? All the functions set when I turned my back, you froze.